गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल मेडिकल क्लासेस बाय डॉक्टर शिवजी कुमार आचार्य डोंट फॉरगेट टू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड आल्सो प्लीज गिव अवर वैल्यूएबल कमेंट्स यू कैन आल्सो विजिट द प्लेलिस्ट इन द प्लेलिस्ट आई हैव गिवन ऑल द सब्जेक्ट्स इन ए सिस्टमेटिक ऑर्डर प्लीज डू विजिट इट नाउ इन द लास्ट क्लास वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट एज पर जर सिंड्रोम सो क्राइटेरिया वन वी हैव सीन डेफिसिट इन सोशलाइजेशन नाउ टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट अनदर प्रॉब्लम इन द एज पर जर किड दैट इज डेफिसिट इन द नॉन वर्बल कम्युनिकेशन बिहेवियर व्हिच इज यूज्ड फॉर द सोशल कम्युनिकेशन now they have got the problem in expressing the feeling in the beginning also i am telling their expression less face they cannot exhibit their emotions so they have problem in expressing the feeling thought in their mind whatever thought they have got in their mind so they are not able to express it okay it is not intentional that's their problem okay it's not intentional they are not able to do that now if you ask him how do you feel now suppose he will say simply i don't that means he can shake his head i don't know or you can you change the pitch and again you ask how do you feel he says i don't know again okay now suppose in a normal child if you are asking this question uh, how do you feel now then in the first case he can say i don't know but if when you ask with a changing the tone my dear boy how you are, how you are feeling now oh i don't know but i am feeling better so this is usually a normal answer given by the normal kid okay but if you are talking about aspergers whatever may be your tone it may be high tone it may be low tone or it may be convincing tone or it may be a sympathetic tone the answer is same i don't know i don't know i don't know okay so now here the problem is to explain the feeling he has got no the problem in explain the feeling he has to convert the feeling emotion and thought process into words isn't it now he has got he has to say i am feeling very good or i am feeling very bad okay he has to say that but the problem is this kid is not able to convert this emotions this feeling into words into words it does not mean that he don't know to convert he has got all the knowledge of words and all vernix area everything is fine but still he has got a problem in that part articulation and formation of that particular sentence or particular word okay so and the sentence so which they feel very difficult to speak this is a basic problem okay so he is not answering means he is not answering it is not mean meaning it does not mean that is not answering intentionally many times if you don't know about this disease we think that he is doing it intentionally isn't it therefore i told that it is very important to understand this disease so same problem is not there in the uh, no another is the same problem is not there in the field of arts where there is no need to explain the things for example fine arts photography music drawing okay so they don't have this problem social communication they have the problem now singing singing they can sing isn't it so because it does not require any social communication simply singing without a, without any expression on the face they may sing but they are singing similarly photography field of photography it does not require any social communication <coughs> similarly fine arts drawing does not require any social communication so usually we will see this asperger kid so they are fantastic and very very expert in this field maybe in the field of drawing maybe in the field of fine arts maybe a very good a singer a very good in photography and even uh, some other cinematic works cinematography and all okay cinematography and all camera works and all so they are very good so asperger syndrome asperger babies these are the plus point in that area where actually social communication is not required so many engineers okay so many engineers uh, like software engineers and all actually so they are engaged with their work no isn't it they do do not re- require any much socialization so they are very good in that field scientist so many scientists because they suppose they develop a area of interest suppose say child is there he has developed area of interest in physics physics okay 
so it's suppose he is very interested in physics then he keep on doing the same thing he will read all the available information regarding the uh, physics and he may be a very good scientist so that is what is observed most of the scientists so they are actually sometime as per just kids it is their uh, that means restricted interest is making this difference okay Th their interest is very much restricted to one particular area so they are studying on the same area they are interested to study they gather all the information at the end of the day so they are very expert in that field they may have average scholastic performances because in the school to far pass you have to score marks in the, all the subjects but after completion of that so they will be very expert in one particular field this is a point that we have to understand so many times we are bothered about the marks that our kids get in the exams as per this kid may get a very average mark or may fail in some of the exams although he is getting 100 of 100 in mathematics or physics one subject area of interest but in other subjects he get failing as a parents we have to understand this problem so therefore this understanding the asperger syndrome is very important it is present in the society in the various degrees it may not be there 100 percent with all the 100 100 percent symptoms but some of the symptoms are there in some of the kids we find it very oftenly therefore it is very important to understand this now now actually looking at the asperger this is not a kid which is much attached to the mom like autism in the autism you can see that child is totally attached to the mom only okay or even that means for every his work mom is required that autism child he is doing whatever he want to do is it because sensory block is there so mother will be always there with that particular kid but this kid as per this kid uh, is desperate to make the friends and he is also not even restricted to the mother attached to the mother also and especially when he go to the teenager life okay he is actually want to make the friends but is not able to do so because of communication problem see as the age passes uh, the spectrum of uh, this disease go on changing okay the problems newer problems are emerging in the small kid a different problem in the high school it's a different problem now when he become a teenager he is actually the personality changes there and he want to make the friends but unfortunately he is not able to make the friends because social communication is affected so for a teenager suppose he is interested in the opposite sex he want to talk with the girl he is not able to talk because social pro communication problem will be there so now suppose if you go to the beach okay normal kids they make the friends with the other kids and they are start playing each other but asperger is uh, thinking how can i go there okay all the others are playing in the sand and all water and all but this kid is staying away and now he is thinking how can i go there after going how i have to talk with them what question they can ask then what i have to answer and at the end he decided better to be there be here only why should i go there because if i go there they will ask so many things and i have to answer and i will have the problem in communication so this is all about criteria one so next we will look into criteria two of asperger's syndrome thank you very much in the next class we will discuss about criteria two till then goodbye and please don't forget to subscribe my channel and also please give your valuable comments thank you very much